Rock and Mayberry? That's right. <laughs> Can you tell me about that? Or? Well, yeah, it was very uh, kind of an interesting thing to me. Um, uh, not, not one of the, the highlights of my life by any means, but uh, yeah, I was cast as the original drunk, and I thought, I'm going to do a drunk a little bit different. And I, uh, whatever I did, uh, they didn't like it. They <laughs> <laughs> didn't like it. No, I remember, oh, God, I can't remember his name. Uh, oh. Well, he was one of the producers of the Air, Outback. Air, Aaron Rubin? No. Uh, Sheldon Leonard, I remember Sheldon. Okay. Sheldon came by scowling. <laughs> so he, they basically didn't like the gear. They didn't like what I did. I thought it was quite different, and it was different, but it's not what they wanted. Huh. What so they wanted was, was a what people expect the television drunk to be, yes. which is exactly what Hal delivered, <laughs> and he did it very well. Yes. And so I, I missed out on that, which was probably a great break for me, but uh, uh, but this is about Hal, but not about me. It was a great break for me because it left me free to do other things that turned into uh, turned out very beneficial to me. Uh, no. no. No? No, I didn't do that. I didn't do that. Um, also, what... I'm curious, uh, what were some of the things you did in Hollywood uh, besides uh, the, the Griffith Show, the one episode you were in in Green Acres and Petticoat Junction? Well, yeah, I do say I did Green Acres and Petticoat Junction for about, well, Petticoat Junction for about seven years and Green Acres for about six years. And before that, I did it. Uh, I did a, uh, a recurring part, not a regular part, but a recurring part as Doc Williams on the Ozzie and Harriet show for about 12 years. I did about 40 motion pictures. Wow. I did hundreds of TV shows, including uh, Gunsmoke, Perry Mason, Hawaii Five-0, Wagon Train, uh, oh, God, you name it, I, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, you're basically retired now, right? Or well, I'm retired now, yeah. Yeah, um, and when did you first go to Hollywood? I got out of the army in 1946, I think. Okay, same time yeah. Hal did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 46, he got out of the military and well, went to Hollywood. I might have not met him then, <laughs> for all I know. Yes. And uh, yeah, then I, uh, um, I, I got in a, a play in Hollywood with a friend of mine that I'd gone to college with. He was directing a play and said, "Would I be in it?" And the agent picked me up, and the next thing you know, I was in a, a movie. <laughs> With my Sarge goes to college. It was a B movie, starring Alan Hale Jr. And I was his professor. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was quite. A, that was 1946. Uh -huh. And I kept at it until oh, till the, the, they canceled our Green Acres and Pettigrew Junction in '70. I think uh -huh. I did a few things after that, but not much. Yeah, I, I moved out of town. Yeah, <laughs> I, I am an.